Today I share with you how to cook Indian chicken biryani. Biryani is one of the food anyone can easily eat. It's so so delicious and every time you come across this rice, nothing will make you not to eat it more than one plate. Today I'm going to be sharing with you anywhere you are, you can get this recipe and you can make your biryani at home. This time around, you don't need to be looking for where they are selling biryani before you can eat your biryani. You can easily get it done inside your kitchen by yourself. I'm going to show you all the ingredients needed for this recipe. Let's dive in. I will be listing out the names of the ingredients I'm using. At the same time, check my comment section to see the accurate measurement of the recipe. So now I'll be adding all the ingredients one after the other. Take note guys, everything is going to list on the screen. Then check my comment section to see the accurate measurements. One of the popular food Indians have. Chicken biryani is one of the most popular food over here in India. And as I'm telling you guys, this biryani is all over the world. There is no country we go, you will not see this chicken biryani. It's all over the world, all because of the goodness of this food. This food is just so, so nice. If you know how to make this, we are going to enjoy it. It's just so, so nice. Everyone loves this recipe. What I have here is fried onions. So you need fried onions to make your biryani. So all I do now is to divide it into two because I'm still going to use it later as I'm cooking. So now I will keep this one aside. Now I'm done adding the first ingredient that is needed for me to get the chicken marinade. So now I'm going to mix it very, very well. So you have to mix it up till all these ingredients get combined with the chicken. Very, very important, guys. Just massage it off, off, off. Okay, guys. One thing I like about eating this chicken biryani is the recipe they use to get this done. I like how Indians use their recipe and I like the benefit of their recipe. The chicken biryani recipe is 100% natural and healthy and lovely and helpful for everyone to eat. It's so so amazing. Now I will be adding one teaspoon of salt. So one thing about this recipe, if you are making this recipe, try to add in salt that you know is going to catch this food because remember we add in lemon. So lemon always drinks salt. So adding a lot of salt so that after cooking, we'll be still having that salt taste. So now I will just get that mix. At this point, I'll cover this for two hours to get marinate. So two hours later, this is what I have. After two hours, it has marinate. So now I'm going to transfer that inside, inside the biryani pot. So this is the pot I will use to get the biryani cook. Just like that, I keep it aside. Over here, we have hot water. So I'll be leaving the names of the ingredients needed for this hot water because this water, I will be using that to get the rice done. So that is just it. I'll be adding the ingredients, then leave the names for you in this cream. Just follow this and get your biryani done. You are going to love it. So that you just had to get this recipe done. It's silly and simple. And all this recipe, anywhere you are, you can get it. All you have to do is to just bring out the names of this ingredient. Just go shop and get it and just get this prepared. Your family is going to love this rice. I'm telling you, this is one of the Christmas rice. Yeah, you are going to love it. Anytime you give this a try, you are going to love it. So now the rice is cooked. I'm just going to transfer that inside the biryani pot. Look at that. Just add it on top of it like this. So I will add in two spoon like this. Then keep the many one first because I'm still going to add it. Then add in the necessary ingredients that is needed. That is the dry onions, which is the fried onions. I just add that. I will just add in the necessary ingredient that's needed. So after that, I will add in the remaining rice. So this one is the remaining rice. I will just add all of it on top of the biryani, just like that. So this one is the remaining rice. All I do now is to add in the remaining leaf. So then add in the remaining onions. At the same time, all the ingredients, I first of all add, I will repeat all of it. So after doing that, all I do now is to add in the water. So you don't need to get fresh water at this point. Use the water that you use to boil the rice, guys. So this is the water I use to get the rice boiled. So that is the water I'm adding to cook it. So I just add a little bit of it. See how I add in it, just corner pot so that it will not get burned. 
to cover that toku for 30 minutes trust me you're going to enjoy that so 30 minutes later you can as well cook with 40 for me i use with nylon that is it i don't bring it out so now i open look at that the aroma is everywhere it cooks so nice everything just gets cooked and lovely my people this is just the best way you can get your chicken biryani done at this point you don't need to be going to shop to see and look for where to chop biryani just follow this process share this video and come and try this by yourself you are going to love it just follow this process i leave all the names of ingredients needed go and get it and enjoy yourself See you guys in my next one. I love you. See you. Bye.